Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. My name remains Scott. Today we are still going to be dealing with dumbbells. In our previous video we used the biceps exercise as a case study. Today we are going to be using the tricep exercise as a case study. Allow me to take a moment to salute you all my returning subscribers. And if you're tuning in for the first time, I do appreciate you. Please click the subscribe button, hit the notification bell so you get notified whenever we upload a video. So the triceps is a muscle having three points of attachment at one end, meaning that it's made up of three heads, the long head, the lateral head, and the middle head which runs underneath the long head. And today we are going to be touching all three parts. Also note that the tricep workout involves two main movements, the elbow extension and elbow flexion. So having said that guys, let's carry on with the first exercise which I call the leaning tricep kickback. Dumbbell leaning tricep kickback. So here you want to bend your body that it forms almost 90 degrees. Holding a dumbbell on each hand with arms placed at 90 degrees. See here guys, drive those elbows up to get a tight squeeze and you kick straight back. The focus here is for you not to bring your elbows below 90 degrees because if you do so, you will be creating momentum and you will not be getting that peak contraction. And you can do this exercise 8 to 12 reps, also depending on the weight of your dumbbell. Dumbbell overhead press. This involves you grabbing the dumbbell and holding it above your head. Grab the dumbbell by the plates, forming a diamond with your hand. Lower the dumbbell behind your head towards your neck. Bending at the elbow while keeping the rest of your arm still and slowly bringing your arm back up to original position. The main focus here guys is to keep the elbows tucked in. But the tip I want to give you here is don't go too far down so you don't lose tension. Just a little bit below 90 degrees. Squeeze those triceps without locking out the elbows. And that's how you get it done. Exercise here guys. We want to target that lateral head of the triceps. And that brings us to exercise number three, which I call the dumbbell crossbody extension. To do this, you want to lay down on the mat, and instead of holding the dumbbell straight up, drag your elbow across your body to keep triceps engaged for optimal rep, and that's your main focus. Bend your elbow and lower the dumbbell across your body to your other shoulder below 90 degrees and squeeze back up. And for this exercise, you can do it 8 to 12 reps, also depending on your strength and weight of the dumbbell. Exercise would be the dumbbell outward tricep extension. Just like the leaning tricep kickback, but with a little vib vibration. Here we want to be working out the lateral height of the tricep. So instead of kicking straight back, here we want to be tilting the dumbbell outward, forming almost a triangle at the top. Make sure both dumbbell attached is order when you contract and keep the dumbbell backward outwardly until your elbow strengthens out. Alright, our first exercise here guys is tricep hammer press. To do this, lay with your back, holding dumbbell on each arm up high. And this exercise guys, you want to do it with a weight that is a little bit heavy so that you can activate those type 2 fibers. You want to make sure both dumbbells are touching each other on top. Now slowly lower them to your chest and expose the back up. This exercise targets the long head of the triceps and you can do it 8 to 12 reps depending also on your strength and weight of the dumbbells. Triangle push-up. Just like a regular push-up but this time place both palms on the floor closer enough to form a diamond or triangle shape in between them. Now you want to drop your body slowly down in a controlled motion and raise back up explosively. So do this as much as you can just to close up your exercise and with this you are going to get a very good contraction in your tricep workouts. So gents, here brings us again to the end of this segment. I believe it has been an informative and also a helpful video. 
If you missed our previous video where we talked about the biceps exercise that you can do with dumbbell, I'm gonna leave a link below so you can click on the link and it will take you straight to that video. Of course, you can see that with a pair of dumbbell, you can achieve a lot already. It's because some of us don't wanna go to the gym. Some of us don't have access to the gym, but with a pair of dumbbells, you can achieve a lot. So guys, if you have found this video informative and helpful, please do give us a thumbs up and also click on that notification bell so you get notified whenever we upload video and don't forget to subscribe guys. Thank you so much and I'll see you all on our next video. Peace out.